Silver School Board voted tonight to allow qualified staff members to carry guns on campus. It's new for you tonight at 10 o'clock. Very few members of the audience spoke out for or against it tonight, but there was an extended and sometimes heated discussion among the board members about whether this action was needed and how best to implement it. The deciding factor seemed to be the time it would take law enforcement to arrive in that remote school district in the event of an emergency. It's a matter of being proactive. This is not about we think our school is going to get attacked. This is not about this. This is about a, it's a fact of life in the United States that we may have to cross this bound. Why can't we be prepared? There's nothing wrong with being prepared. The final vote was three to two. One board member was against it entirely, while another wanted more specifics about training before the resolution was approved. And Hanover now joins two other rural school districts in Colorado where teachers or staff members are allowed to carry firearms. One is in the town of Brixdale near Greeley. The other is Dove Creek, just northeast of Durango. Both districts made the change in 2013, a year after the Sandy Hook massacre. In Dove Creek, the decision came several years after a plot by two students to kill their principal. Of course,